Assalamu alaikum. In this video, we are going to discuss an important topic of public international law, recognition and its theory. We know that recognition may be recognition of state, recognition of government, recognition of liberation movement, recognition of government in exile. Recognition is a process by which a new state acquires its international personality. By recognition, existing states declare that a newly independent state acquires a statehood to be the member of the international community. By recognition, existing state acknowledge the existence and independence of a new state. According to Professor Offenheim, in recognizing a state as a member of international community, the existing states declare that in their opinion the new state fulfills the condition of statehood as required by international law. Okay. According to Kelson, to be recognized as a member of international community, a new state must fulfill some condition such as the state must be politically organized. It should have control over a definite territory. This control should be permanent. The state must be independent. Okay. Now the question is, is recognition by one state to another state compulsory? The answer of this question can be given by two theory. Let's see what is the theory of recognition. There are two theory of recognition: constructive theory and declaratory theory. According to constructive theory, recognition is compulsory. Without recognition, a state cannot exist. Similarly, without recognition, a government cannot get validity. Only by the recognition, a government get ability to rule the concerned state. Hegel, Angelotti, Holland, and Offenheim are the chief advocate of this theory. Okay, and then let's see the declaratory theory of recognition. Under this theory, recognition is not compulsory. To exist as a state, recognition is not a compulsory element. According to Article 1 of the Montevideo Convention of 1933, four elements are compulsory for a state. On the reasonable population to the definite territory, the government and for sovereignty. Uh, when a state acquires these four elements, it is enough to be a state. Recognition is not compulsory. It's merely a acknowledgement of the existing state by which the existing state acknowledge the existence of new state it doesn't create a new state just acknowledge there is a state in all without recognition the united nation created state the name of the state is israel it is not recognized state okay Thanks for watching. Please don't forget to subscribe. Thank you.